Welcome to Hitacolic's Kit, Kit's YouTube channel. <laughs> it's Corinne here today, and I'm making a video with my two girls. We're going to make some, um, this one has to keep sticking ahead. So anyway, here we are. We're going to be making a different kind of project for you today. We have some Christmas ball balls, just some clear ones. I got these one from Riot. They're just plastic and we're going to use some of our ink from the kit and we're going to put it in here and make it pretty. I, um, I've got some ink from a past kit that, um, because the girls want to use pink obviously and I've got a little bit of gold ink that I got from my stash. Um, I think we can use these inks and it'll be all good. I haven't done this before so it will be an experiment. <laughs> um, you can use this with alcohol inks as well, which I also have, but they didn't come in the kit, so that would be no point in showing you. So I've just Hi. shaked up everything that I can, and you just need some straws. Nothing too outrageous here. Nice and easy. One for you, one for you. And um, I'll show you later how to do it on camera, how it will look underneath, you know, what I mean. Um, but I wanted you to see, and the girls wanted to be in, so. So we'll start off with yours, Heidi Mighty. What colour would you like, Heidi? You want some pink? So we just unscrew it. Put a couple of drops of pink in. And we'll we shake them in around. And you put that in, put the straw in, stop, blow. <laughs> yes, that was better in my head. Apparently, I'm going to get covered in ink. We might give you this, and we'll just. We've got lots of would you like some of this color ink in there as well this is purple purple ink in here as well we'll only put a little bit on i think i may have put too much ink in this one now we'll just roll it around drop the excess excess ink onto the paper towel so now i'll put some purple in Pretty. Oh, that does look pretty. Mm. Um, you can blow if you want. Blow. <laughs> Struggle. This three-year-old doesn't know how to blow in a straw properly, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. We'll drain that excess out. I don't know how this is going to go, but we'll soon see. So we'll just drop a little bit of gold in here. Oh. Well, that was a bad. bad. <laughs> and we'll just do the same thing. I'll blow it around. This is what it ends up like it's looking. ended up looking like. You probably do with it a little bit more of the gold. gold. Dropped onto the side or something. I like that kiss as well. I like that kiss as well. Look at that. I like this. Right. So, there it is. Beautiful. Yep. Looks good. Pretty. So that's the end of it. And that's what it ends up looking like. It looks a lot nicer in yeah. person, that's for sure. It looks nice. So I'll just leave that one over there to dry and now that's it's right. Georgie yeah. Ann's turn. Okay. What colour are we gonna use, Georgie? The aqua. 
Same as me. We're, we're doing the same thing because I was gonna do blue with aqua. Aqua. It's very hard to see on camera. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Now, what do you want to do? Not Put ready. some glitter in. This is a bit pretty. of a purple Jackie in Georgia. It looks, it looks pretty. Get all that ink out. That's what it looks like. Put one on the bottom. It looks like. Put it everywhere. I'll blow it around. This is mine. Okay, guys. That was the live video. And this one's just a quick voiceover for the last one so you can see exactly what I'm doing. I hope you enjoyed the live bit. It was, um, the kids really enjoyed making the, the ball balls and the video, as you can see. <laughs> the big one's a bit crazy. Georgie, she, um, loves the camera. But anyway, so, um, I'm voiceovering this a few weeks after I made these baubles so I can say that they were successful and that they um, the inks did end up drying and sticking and I think the glitter really helped along that process I know that I don't think I show the process of me actually putting the glitter in the balls for some reason um, probably because I need to look up really close my eyes aren't what they used to be but um it really helped them to I don't know, for the colour to dry out, I suppose. And um, they looked a lot nicer too with the glitter in. Um, yeah, I'm just putting the ink in the ball balls. The straws were hopeless. Um, they didn't work at all, really. It was just easier to put the, the ink in, dropping it in like this, and just moving the ball ball around until it was, you know, coated where I wanted to coat it and whatever else. And here I am just putting those little thickers on there and I just coated them with um, Tombow glue. That's just the tops being put back in um, so we can hang them on the tree. But yeah, the Tombow, Tombow glue didn't stick the best. Um, I'll probably try um, maybe some hot glue next time. I'm not sure how to go on the plastic though. Wouldn't want to heat it too much um, or maybe even super glue but um, yeah I don't know I'll see how they go next year when we pull them out I suppose but yeah they worked out well um, the kids just packed them away today actually and they made sure they looked over them again and, and they love them so thanks for watching guys i hope this inspires you to try something out of the box with your kits that we mostly get to scrapbook with but there's a lot of other uses that you may not even think about so i hope you enjoyed watching this video i hope that the um live video wasn't too hard to watch i know that the girls can get very crazy and loud and i tried to chop most of the craziness out but yeah thanks for watching bye